A U.S. technology giant, IBM, has launched its first Africa-based research laboratory in Nairobi. The investment is meant to cater for clients across Africa. Kenya is a leading technology hub on the continent. The lab is hosted by the Catholic University of Eastern Africa. Focus on Africa's Ansoy spoke to IBM's director in, Kenyan, in the Kenyan capital, Nairobi. This is Africa's first technology research laboratory. It brings together some of the best brains from across the world to solve some of the biggest challenges facing Africa today, from transport to agriculture to healthcare. And the man driving that here is Dr. Kamal Bhattacharya. Why Africa? What attracted you to Nairobi? Well, Africa has been a tremendous uh, growth story. And um, we had decided to make an investment into the science and technology part because we believe that through science and technology and through research we can help Africa to leapfrog to the point where it needs to be given the grand challenges that we see. And what's the significance of setting up such a facility here in Africa? Well see my personal perspective as a scientist is that research is a way to challenge the status quo. And our approach is to think about the tremendous wealth of information that actually exists in Africa about financial inclusion, about people who are affected by, you know, 25 percent of the world's disease burden. Bring this data together, look at the correlations, look at the different aspects of it, and create innovations that will help to significantly, by an order of magnitude, improve the challenges to a point that we can actually commercialize them and impact people's lives. Many thanks, Dr. Kamal. Now, this is a collaborative effort between IBM and some of the best brains in technology research here in Africa and across the world. And we'll see the generation of some um, tools and applications, technology-based, that will solve some of Africa's problems. And Soy reporting there from Nairobi. This is Focus on Africa from BBC World News.